in many respects, it's little things through the development process. For instance, in the city of Aldosta now, if you want to develop uh, a piece of property that's greater than an acre, you have to retain your stormwater. It's a requirement. Um, and there's some very innovative things that they're doing. As an example, the two new Walgreens that we have in Valdosta, uh, built on the northern end of the city, both have underground stormwater storage. You have parking lot on the top, stormwater management beneath the ground. Um, we're seeing more and more of that type of creative way to utilize the space. Yes, sir? What, how, what kind of cost? Uh, that's implemented, of course, with a new store during construction. Does it add significantly to the cost of uh, their building? It does. I'm, and I don't know how much money it, um, it is. I've personally not seen those numbers. But yes, it is an added expense. Mm -hmm. I think you need to counter that. The cost of dealing with flood damage should occur. Yeah. yeah. But, see, we're 